In May 2016, John Timms set out to raise funds for St Luke's Care Home by walking along five canals from Birmingham to Runcorn. John, his son Dave and friend Derek took on the challenge to honour their much-loved wife, mother and friend, Marion, who lived at St Luke's until she passed away. I think we set, we set out originally to raise awareness. Going back to St Luke's, I think, for me, that's the kind of thing that pulled us through. I thought I saw the work they did for me, Mum, and look after me, Mum, and the, the work they do for the people there. And everyone's an individual, and I think that allowed us to get through there with the, the work we've done. John proudly presented a cheque for over £3,000 to our specialist dementia care home during a celebration event hosted by St Luke's as a thank you. John's delivering our cheques today um, and with that money we've done our Green Fingers um, garden project and as you can see there's been a massive transformation. The celebration officially launched the home's new gardens which were created by the home staff as part of a special team building challenge and supported by John's fundraising efforts. Viking star player Gil Dudson was guest of honour to the celebratory event to congratulate John on his phenomenal achievement. I spoke to John, had a chat with him earlier, you know what he's done is amazing and the money that he's raised as you can see with the gardens has gone to really good use. When Marion died we decided that we wanted to do something so we decided on this one because of the, the way the home has treated Marion looked after her and looked after the family since she died. It's nice to see that some of the money is being taken to good use. The loops has been brilliant for me, even after she died. They've invited me back, I've been back nearly every week and I love it, I love the people there. It's something we just felt we wanted to do. As you can see, there's been a massive transformation. So without John, none of this would have been possible. 